here is the coolest law enforcement vehicle I have ever seen. It is called the Titan DS SWAT. Check this out. You got your lights, you got your cool police lights. Look at this, right here, also up there. And then, check this out, you got remotes. Here we go, let's see what this does. Turn this one on. Oh, and then turn this one on. Watch it here. Yes, and then, this is what we all like to do. <laughs> Play with it. <laughs> Look at it here. So it moves, so you can see. So there are your spotlights. This is so freaking cool. How cool is this, man? Okay, so many features. Let's get to it. Right here, you have military grade wheels and run flat tires. So if this gets shot straight through with a bullet, it will actually run for another 50 kilometers, which is kind of crazy. Now just check out the size of this beast. Look at this. Look at this, guys. This is almost six and a half meters long. Huge! All right, now this right here, this paint has the coolest name. It is called Raptor Paint and it's textured and it's super black. It's like, it's like blacked out. It's crazy. All right, round here, you got your extra wheel and you won't believe what this is. I'll show you inside. That is cool. So you've got the SWAT on the back, Titan DS SWAT, that's what it's called. And it's from Inca's Armored Vehicles here. And they're all made here in Dubai, which is very cool. So this is where we are. Look around, desert everywhere. It's just crazy. There was a sandstorm yesterday, so it's all cleared up, thank thankfully. Before we get in though, check this out. Two gas tanks, one here, there we go. And one over here. And that means that it has a range of up to 800 kilometers. So you fill those two babies off. This is where it gets exciting. Are you ready? Okay, right, JP, I'm gonna hand you these. Thank you. Here we go. All right. This is where all the cool features are. This is like heaven for me, buttons everywhere. Check this out guys. So this is a gun port. So these babies are everywhere. You got one here, you got one here, and then here as well. Look, they're everywhere. <laughs> anyway, they're everywhere. <laughs> this right here goes up and down, okay, depending on the height of the person for this right here. Check this out. All right, now I'm just gonna do this and then do this. Woo, here we go. Hey, look at this, 360 turret. And look, it moves all the way around, 360. <laughs> and back again, go back. Oh, okay, so, just there, just there, actually move it. There we go, there we go, oh. <sighs> okay, that was exhausting. So you can actually mount a, a machine gun or a rocket launcher from here. And this spins all the way around, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Woo. They supply these vehicles to uh, the police all over the world here from Dubai. And they've already shipped out over 10,000 of these babies. So much more to show you. Like, look at this. You've got two escape hatches. An escape hatch here. It's very easy to open, actually. And then that just stays like this. And then... And then these things here, right? This is an extra ventilation system so that if there's any dangerous gases inside, it will pull that air out of the cabin. Now you've got your three point harness, harnesses here, and see, strap in like this, and it can fit a max of 10 people. This floor right here is special. Doesn't look special at all, it just looks like the floor. However, this has something called Stanag 2 level blast protection, which means it can actually withstand two hand grenades going off at the same time or six 
kilograms of explosive force here through this floor. That is absolutely insane. The whole thing you can imagine is very highly protected. You can actually customize this vehicle. So some of the things you've seen are actually extras, but you can also get a missile detection system put on the roof of this vehicle. You can also get an additional oxygen uh, supply. So in case there's gases outside, the oxygen around the car is, is toxic and you can't breathe it, it will actually pump through a fresh air from oxygen tanks held within the vehicle. This is actually based on a Dodge Ram 5500. There it is, the Ram. And they've kept all of this, the, the dash, as standard, just so that it's user friendly for the person driving the car. It's not difficult at all. Now down here, this is where you have your lights. So this is where all the police lights are switched on and off at the front. It's cool. Here, storage, but it can also turn into an extra seat. There you go. There's your seat, JP. <laughs> for the kids. There you go. They also do civilian vehicles. So this is fully bulletproof and can withstand grenades as well. So look at this, you wouldn't know, right? You would have no idea. It's a Toyota Land Cruiser with full protection. Check this out. Look. Heavy doors. You've got the bulletproof glass. Look how thick, right? And even when you do this, it's just deactivated because it won't roll down because it's so thick now. And these doors are out. Oi! You're gonna be safe in that, that's for sure. They can do B6 or B7 level of protection. That basically means how thick is the steel? The same as on that vehicle, it has run flat tires. So if this tire is punctured at all, you can still drive on the tire for about 50 kilometers. So you can get out of that situation. They brought this out for us to see today because this, you'd have no idea was fully protected, would you? But it is, it's cool, huh? All right, time to drive this baby back. Beck, my man, CEO of Inca's Armoured Vehicles. How are you, man? Good. Good. Right, you've got the key, the magic key. Yes. Here we go. All right, come with me. Thank you. This goes up and then out. <laughs> this is obviously not my specialty, opening military grade doors. All right. I've never, ever driven anything like this. I mean, this is on another level. Right, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Okay, so this, in theory, should be easy to drive because it's a Dodge Ram. So here we go, all the way down. And we've got the parking brake off and I think we're ready to go. Holy moly, let's do this. Ready? <laughs> take it off road, go take it off road. Wanna take it off road? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> so this can go up to a hundred and sixty kilometers an hour. And so what they've done is they've tuned the original Dodge Ram engine. And you can drive up to 800 kilometers with the two fuel tanks. All right, here we go, here we go. Check left and right. Oncoming military truck. Ah! Jeez. Massive thank you to Inca's Armoured Vehicles uh, for showing us around this beast. All right, we're out.